Is there an iceberg we didn't hit yet? Eh, it's coming. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, that's bad. Okay, uh, I think the engine's like ex trying to accelerate and keep it out of the water. Uh, how it hasn't flooded, I don't know. YouTube, Modal Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks, and folks, we are finally back in Sinking Ship Survival, and boy, I'm excited. Uh, so we have a brand new ship here, it's by Mimp. It is a multi-purpose vessel, you can see the name on the screen if you guys want to go download this. You can check it down in the description, and this thing is actually rather impressive. Got a lot of neat features and an awesome interior. And you know what? We're gonna try to survive here in the Arctic because we haven't dodged any icebergs in a while. So if you guys are enjoying Stormworks on the channel, you know what to do, hit that thumbs up button. Also, I'm completely sideways right now. We're not starting the sinking survival yet. Uh, I don't need a capsize. You know, this is gonna end up like the Titanic. Like we're gonna hit one of these big old icebergs and then we're gonna be going down. Uh, maybe we can go find a door to float on or something. Speaking of, how do we survive in this? That's a good question. All right, we need to get to the open ocean. There is a little chart area where we could set waypoints, uh, but I don't trust it to not drive us into an iceberg. So I'm gonna try to turn left. looks like we have a little bit of open sea here, unless we grind into this big old iceberg right here. Folks, uh, <laughs> the waves are carrying us one way and we're about to boop right into this iceberg. No, okay. That wasn't so bad. I'm pretty sure we have a reverse on here. Hold on, let's go reverse. All right. There we go. By the way, we have the news. This is a, a neat little screen I don't think I've ever seen before. Are we going backwards? Help. Uh, is this referring to us? I kind of want to say it is. Hold on, let's see. Can we... Are we still going backwards? I can't really tell. Uh, this thing I don't think was meant for immediate, like, high winds and stuff. But if you look at the positive side, we're somewhat okay. Okay here like we have a little bit of damage in the front, but that's about it I'm gonna try to back us up real quick and see if we can go that direction folks I am currently trying to turn the vessel to the left and I'm about to run back into the same iceberg again I promise I'm not doing this on purpose. Okay, that one might have done a little bit more damage, but Look at the positives. Oh, there is no positive side. Oh, no, we're gonna die a couple seconds into uh, the video aren't we? Hey there we go. Okay, we're good. Uh, as I was saying, we're gonna go check out the interior on this thing. Uh, okay, let's slow it down just a little bit here. Uh, I kind of need to maneuver out. I, I didn't think that, you know, it was gonna be this bad right around the starting island. But yeah, the weather is horrible. By the way, I was letting the weather do whatever it wanted to. And for some reason, when the uh, custom games start, it immediately starts in a really bad weather. Why won't this turn anymore? Folks, I think we broke something. <laughs> Is there an iceberg we didn't hit yet? I feel like I want to be perfect on this, right? This kind of is like an old lady in a parking lot, like trying to park and they're grinding against all the, uh, all the cars. Uh, yeah, let's, let's stop this and assess the damage real quick. Uh, this can't be that bad, right? Editor, right? It is what it is. <laughs> you know, we're going to go ahead and turn on those bilge pumps just in case we need those. Yeah, I don't think this thing was meant for really, really high waves. We might have to scratch this plan and maybe go back to the normal islands. At least we have a big open area. Oh, man. Okay, that sounds terrible. All right, so here, let's go uh, do a little look-see and see how we get downstairs. By the way, the, uh, the interior of this thing is absolutely... Oh, I'm getting seasick here. It's absolutely fantastic. The medical room? How do we go down? Is it out? Oh, there it is. Found the stairs. Oh, this is sideways. Okay. Uh, we got the kitchen down into here. Okay. Okay, we don't want to open that. <laughs> that was water. Uh, okay, so the kitchen's back here. Oh, I can't move around in this right now. Uh, let's go hallway lights. Where is potentially the engine room? Okay, we got vents heading this way. Wait, solid rocket fuel. Is that a thing? Oh, here's the front. Okay, hey, look. 
You know what? This actually worked out. Oh, jeez. Back, 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 back. Um, here, close that. Let's go straight up to the uh, the bridge here. I think there's an entrance up here. Uh, let's try not to hit the next iceberg. We've already hit enough today. Okay, whoa it up. There we go. We just slapped on the brakes on that bad boy. All right, let's uh let's throttle down for a second. We need to assess the damage here. Uh, we didn't actually get out very far, did we? Well, if we go down, we're kind of in the middle of a bunch of islands right now. Uh, let's just hope the weather doesn't get worse. Uh, let's go see if we can do a little... Uh, reconnaissance in the engine area oh my there is damage everywhere uh hold on if we go down here uh, uh oh that's water um okay here we're good here you know you know, it might be like a double uh, hole or something so maybe it's not taking on water Let's see anchor room there's a workshop in here you know i gotta give it a minute this thing looks absolutely fantastic there's a lot of work areas in here Let's see we got storage equipment okay we might need the welding torch uh yeah i think that should be it here let's go to wait games room what is the games room Wait, what the heck? They got a full-blown arcade in here. Huh? What's on TV? Man continues to turn pipe. No. Oh, I think the TV went out. Um, there's a bar in here. That's probably uh, the last thing that we need right now. All right, let's go see if we can uh, maybe find the engine room here. It's bound to be here somewhere. Okay, anchor room is currently taking on water. Okay, let's see if we... Oh. Uh, I think it's supposed to have water in it, right? Those are open. Okay, maybe this is uh, okay over here. All right, let's keep this room sealed. We need to get further down into the ship. I think I just slammed the door into my face. All right, here. Uh, let's see if we can go down to maybe an engine room. There might not be an engine room. Maybe it's uh, completely uh, hollow. Wait. Are we tilting forward? No, I think we're okay. Oh, here we go. This is what I was uh, looking for, huh? Let's light this up. Do we have water in here anywhere? Okay, this is storage. I see damage over here. That's a lot of damage. Guess we can go ahead and maybe try to repair some of this. Uh, keep some leaks from happening. We're going to continue this journey. You know what? We're not going to reset. I thought maybe we'd have to reset. But you know what? It's challenging in the waters of the Arctic. All right. So we found the engine room. We have a bit of an issue. Um, I saw some water coming through here. Okay. Let's uh, prepare for the worst. Ah. Yep. There's, okay, there's water coming from somewhere. It's on. Let's look around in here. You know what? The engines actually seem pretty okay. They look perfectly uh, functional here. There's a maintenance hat. Okay, a little bit of water came out. Now, maintenance hatch looks good. All right, so this leads into the... Okay, this is where there's probably a bit of an issue. Uh, Look for holes on the side. There's the damage. Okay, so if we repair this, there's a potential we can keep this from completely flooding. All right, and we have bilge pumps in here. You got to keep that in mind. So, in theory, some of the water's getting pumped out. We can at least slow it. I don't think I can make this torch work under. Well, I can kind of do it, but I have to keep my head above. Oh, those are the bilge pumps right there, I think. Okay, we're trying to repair our ship. We are capsizing right now. Wait, what is that? That is letting a ton of water. Is that the... S Wait. Why do I feel like that is on? Oh, shut that. Look at that. Okay, so I think we've... We're really sideways, by the way. I think we've somewhat repaired this. I'm going to hope that the bilge pumps remove the rest of this water. And uh, let's go back up to the bridge and let's see if we can get moving here. All right. We're uh, coming back up to the top. Uh, on. Why are we so sideways right now? Why do I feel like we took on too much water? This, uh, this might be bad. I think we're sinking. I don't think there's a way to stop. Oh, yeah. We have indeed uh, about tipped over. All right, it's getting dark. I think our only option right now is to fire this thing up and hopefully drive out of it. All right, so there's that. What is on screen right now? What are we watching? Well, the engine starts, so that's a thing. Do we have actual... Oh, no. Folks, we're uh, we're going down. Let's go ahead and activate all the emergency beacons. I didn't see if there was any sort of like... Uh lifeboats or buoys or anything i don't think there's a lifeboat do we have a buoy on the back oh and i can't even get to the front here oh uh, we got emergency beacons and stuff do we have flares uh let's see emergency beacon is on okay foghorn beep it a couple times maybe somebody will hear us dying okay i think there's a chance we might want to climb to the top of this and hope that we can get off i wonder was there a was there any sort of arctic clothes down in that storage probably should have checked all right, well, this is totally not fine right now. Oh, no, you got to be kidding me. This is the quickest I think I've ever sank a ship. Actually, don't quote me on that because I feel like somebody's going to drag up an old video where it went down even quicker. Folks, I think we're going to need to go 
to the normal land and try this. I feel like uh, I failed Memp here because, yeah, I destroyed this thing really quick. I destroyed it without even hitting the scuttle button. All right, there she goes to the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, is that a rescue helicopter? Hey, uh, if I had a flare, maybe we can come... Nope, never mind. They left. All right, well, let's go to the mainland. So, uh, that was our ship last time. You want to hear something fun? You know the reason why I was having problems uh, steering this bad boy? So I was up here clicking buttons like Komodo normally does, and I clicked all the buttons. I thought maybe the waves were too rough, but if you click this last one, which I thought was just a screen, I was going click, 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 click. You click this last one, it turns on autopilot. Guess what happens when you have autopilot on? You can't control the rudders. Komodo couldn't control the rudders. I don't think it would have helped me a whole lot because I was already having a ton of issues hitting everything. But look at this. The boat works perfectly fine. <laughs> I feel like I owe, a, I owe an apology to Mimp. I can only imagine what my editor's thinking right now. Maybe my editor spotted it. Did you spot it, Mr. Editor Person? <laughs> well, you guys got a little bit of sinking ship survival anyway, so... Anyways, we can test it out. It works great. Uh, is there any other higher gears? Or I think we're at max right now. Hold on, let's make sure. Yeah, cruise is pretty good. Very cool multi-purpose vessel. What's this back here? Oh, here's the radio system. There is a crane at the back. So what is kind of cool is I think there is a pretty cool little waypoint system in here. Let me see if I can figure out how to work it. So we can turn this on. Do we just click where we want to go? Is that the waypoints? So clicking this screen, is it going to actually turn me around? What if I click this waypoint off here? Oh, that looped us around. Maybe C for clear. Okay, so that clears it. So what if we set our next waypoint here? Look at that, the ship starts to turn. That's a cool waypoint system. I'm actually really impressed by that. Uh, so yeah, you can set this to go wherever you want, including right into an island or something. Can we uh, do a waypoint into a tsunami? I feel like that'd be a bad idea, but it also seems like it's kind of a fun idea too. So real quick to do the ship justice, we're gonna go through and make sure we didn't really miss anything. We're gonna do kind of a visual tour of some of the rooms. Uh, this thing is loaded down with cabins. You got like a little, uh, looks like maybe a little bit more of a master. Oh no, this is the, the medical area. Wait, was this the captain's quarters? All right, so this was the captain's quarters. So I'm assuming the crew quarters might be below this. Oh, here we go. This is the crew bunks down here. So overall, rather impressive. Uh, there's another crew bunk there. Of course, you have like the kitchen and stuff and then all the uh, medical rooms and of course, you had the uh, the engine room and that little maintenance area here where we tried to save it from sinking, but ultimately Komodo failed. But yeah, very impressive creation nonetheless. So, uh, you know, do you think we can autopilot into a tsunami? Let's go ahead and try it real quick. We'll see what happens to the ship. All right, tsunami, which way are you going? Okay, it's coming to the side. So what we want to do, let's clear. Okay, so we are heading there. Tsunami's about into here. So let's go turn us slightly. Come on. No, let's go in the uh, opposite direction. No, 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 no. Clear. What about this way? I'm trying to get it to turn. Okay, that's definitely the wrong direction. So the front of the boat's aimed towards the point. So in theory, we want to go here. There we go. Okay, so it's going to autopilot and turn into the tsunami. I don't know if it's turning sharp enough. I feel like we need to maybe cut that a little sharper. What about that? Oh, there we go. We're trying to run into it. Eh, it's coming. <laughs> Man, this seemed like a really big ship. And then you see the really big tsunami and you go, maybe this isn't so big. Uh, do we think we're going to be able to hold on here? Here we go. Let's feel the power of the tsunami. You know, a new test that I'm going to be able to do soon is going to be a weapons test because the weapons DLC is coming soon to Stormworks, so we're going to be able to launch missiles at the boats and not like the little user-created missiles. We're going to get to launch actual missiles, and oh, that is incredible. <gasps> oh, okay, that's some style points there. It just landed on the back of the tsunami. Uh-oh. 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 Um... Keep rotating, keep rotating, and nailed it. I meant to do that. Totally meant to do that. Okay, the doors are good. That's what uh, popped open last time, the little scuttle doors, which by the way, if you want to see where the scuttle is, I mean, I might as well show it to you guys. Here we go, scuttle unlock. Uh, it's got a nice unlock little start up here. And we go click. And uh, now she's slowly sinking. Uh, maybe if we uh, got into some sort of storm, I don't know, kind of like this. There we go, yeah, storm. Okay, let's see how long this thing lasts above the water. Uh, let's go ahead and push the clutch back in. Uh, let's keep moving at least. What is that 
floating in the wait what, what are all those red lights is that the that looks creepy it looks like aliens but i think that might be the wind turbine island oh it is ho oh. ho that kind of scared me. I looked up and I was like, uh, that doesn't look normal. All right, so we're going to try to turn and maybe race towards the shore. Let's go ahead and turn off that button Komodo accidentally hit at the first of the uh, video. So this scuttle, I think, works relatively quick. We're already starting to list over to the side, kind of like the way we sank the first time, but both doors are open. That's still kind of cool having the doors on the bottom. Say if you didn't even have a scuttle, but you want that opportunity if you were to hit something that it would sink faster so a door would swing open. That's kind of cool. Oh, this is going down quick. Um, It might be time for that emergency beacon again. Hold on. Uh, the only thing I would like to see if there was like an extra block here to get through because it is kind of hard to move to the front of this. Okay, here we go. Emergency beacons are on. I don't see a flare gun. I know we're starting to capsize though. Uh, now might be the time to run. All right, let's get to the supply area real quick. Uh, where was the equipment? I think it's, is it right over here? Wait, thermal clothing. It's got to be right in here. Oh, this is captain's, uh, no, it's captain's quarters. No, no, no. We need to go down a little further. Ho, oh. ho. I don't know, is the water actually going to the inside here, or how is this working? Oh, and here's this. Okay, I think the equipment locker might be down here. Basic storage and equipment. Here we go. Oh, let's turn on some lights in here real quick. Uh, flares! That's what we need. I need the flare gun ammo and the flare gun. Okay, let's head back up. Uh, oh no, I think I'm stuck. Okay. Uh, equipment room, staircase. Oh, no, 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 close that, close that. Okay, that's the side of the, wait a minute. Did we go down? Oh, that's bad. Okay, uh, I think the engine's like ex trying to accelerate and keep it out of the water. Uh, how it hasn't flooded, I don't know. Can you name a more lonely feeling than going down with a ship like this? All right, we're gonna make a run for it or a swim for it, I guess. Ooh. Oh yeah, the pressure's bad. Oh, there's no way we can make it to the top. We were totally screwed there and we're done. <laughs> I'm not really sure what we learned here today. We learned that that is a really awesome creation. You guys should go check it out. It'll be linked down in the description. Uh, if you guys want to see more Sinking Survival, you know what to do. Hit the thumbs up button, and we will see you guys next time.